Oh, it's happening. Oh, it's happening. Oh, come on. They're going to start unsubscribing now. Oh. Uh, come on. Come on. Come on. Woo! We just hit 100,000, baby. Holy shit, that feels good to see. Oh, my God. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's going to be a good day. This is going to be a great video. I've been wanting to do this for I don't know how long, but what is going on everybody? How are y'all doing today? I hope y'all guys are living your best lives. My truck is actually 100% disgusting from riding up and down this gravel field. But today, actually before I get into today's video, I do want to say thank y'all for 100,000 subscribers. I literally could not be doing this without y'all. I sent in the thing to get my plaque in from YouTube, so hopefully that should be coming in the mail. When it does, of course, I will be showing that off to you. So thank y'all so much for 100,000 subscribers. It really does mean the world to me that we are continuously growing even right now. I think right now we're already at 104,000. We're right here, so whatever that number is, that's where we're at. But today, I'm not washing the truck. I'm doing some of the truck, but I'm not washing it. Today, we are cutting the exhaust off of the Chevrolet. So today, I'm not gonna cut the entire exhaust off of it. Actually, I'm just gonna cut right after the muffler and take that second resonator off and the tailpipe. And then after that, we're gonna be solid. But maybe once I get this thing inspected, then I might cut the muffler off. But now I actually did cut the muffler off of my green truck. If y'all guys haven't seen that, it's actually linked in the description. So if y'all guys wanna go watch that and me cutting the exhaust off of my green truck, the moldy pickle, then y'all go check that out in the description below. Today, 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 we are cutting. So right here is my muffler. Right back there is the hanger. And then it goes to a resonator. Y'all can see that right there. And then after the resonator, it comes out of the tailpipe. What we're gonna be cutting is right there after the muffler today. Then, like I said, after I go and get this thing inspected, then I might cut the muffler off of it. I'm not sure. Don't know what type of exhaust system I want to do to this truck yet, but I do know that one, it is way too quiet. So. I need to sign that Jake break over there. I'm honestly so excited. I actually have to go and find the Sawzall because I have not used the Sawzall since the last time when I cut my exhaust off the green truck. And I think that was like four days before I joined the Air Force. So like November 3rd or November 4th or 5th of 2017 is when I cut my exhaust off the green truck. So bringing back the old school memories. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Let's get to it. Oh. Thank God younger me bought some diamond cutted blades for metal. So we're gonna go ahead and slap that on there and uh, go ahead and start chopping. Well, obviously this would not be a exhaust cutoff video if I did not show you what it sounds like before. So let's go ahead and hear how quiet and bad this thing sounds. And hopefully this resonator is taking up a lot of noise and it's going to sound a little bit more decent than what it does now. Obviously it's not going to sound straight pipe because I'm definitely not doing that. I'm not doing cat back straights and six inch tips and angle. I'm not, no, I'm not doing that. So as you can tell, it's got some rumble to it, just a little bit, nothing crazy. <laughs> that bad boy is getting cut off today. I'm ready to cut. I do have to go find safety glasses, and I know safety glasses are not cool, but you know what is cool? Having both of your eyes. But I'm going to wear them, and you should always wear them too. I'm going to practice safe, so y'all guys need to practice safe stuff also in your life. Whoa, we are styling, profiling now. Probably right here is where we're going to be cutting, somewhere along this area. So uh, I got the saws off. Let's get to chopping. Huh. 
Well, that's not good. I didn't even think about the hanger sitting right there. I probably should have just cut it off after the hanger. That way this thing has some durability. But now, currently sitting on my knee, completely free. Got me a nice cut right there, but I think I might have messed this up. So now I'm currently just laying on the ground. Holding up. <laughs> I love my life. Holding up my muffler with my knee. So I guess I'm just going to go ahead and cut the muffler off too because, I mean... I don't, I don't understand why I, why I decided to work on things myself because it never goes right. So, you know, remember how I said I wasn't going to cut the muffler off? Yeah, well, I lied. I'm cutting the muffler off. I guess. <laughs> Exciting times. Honestly, I want to know what it sounds like. So, <laughs> before I cut anything out, I am going to start it to see what it sounds like. It's definitely got just a little bit more rumble. It's definitely not as loud as what I thought it was going to be. I can't leave that muffler just sitting on there or else it's going to hang down and bend my pipe. So uh, I'm just going to go ahead and cut the muffler off. Exciting times. Hope I can still get this thing inspected because uh, if not, I guess I'm taking it to Kyle's to go get something welded back on. And uh, I can't put y'all on the tripod to cut the muffler. Well, I guess I could. I can just go get me a jack stand because the, currently my tripod is holding up my muffler. Super exciting times. We really love doing this YouTube thing by yourself. Nobody can tell you like, no, that's not a good idea. You just gotta send it. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab me a jack stand. That way I can hold that muffler up and then uh, chop it off. Well, the jack stand's on, hold the muffler up. Now, I guess I'm just gonna cut it right there on that weld. I mean, how much worse could it possibly get? Probably gonna make a really big bang when this thing falls, but I mean, uh huh. -huh. As you can see the valve inside there, I don't know what that's for or why there's water leaking out of my muffler. That's exciting too, but uh, the muffler's off. Uh, anybody wants a muffler off of a 2015 Chevrolet? DM me on Instagram. Well, before I do anything else, I gotta go ahead and get this tailpipe off of this hanger. Should not be that difficult. I hope this truck does not sound like a damn tractor, even though I'm sure it's going to. Should be a great time. Should sound completely great. All right, cool. Oh, I hate taking these off. They're always so old. All right, well, I've come to the final decision that I'm just gonna cut these hangers off, or not the hangers, but I don't need them. So I'm just gonna chop that off, chop that one up there off, chop that one by there off, and this thing should just fall because I don't feel like dealing with it. So I'm not gonna deal with it. Oh, look at my blade. That's high quality. We love that. All right, I'm gonna give me a different blade because I don't like the way that one looks and it's scaring me a lot. Yeah, there's no way I was going to be able to get that off like that. By trying to just get it out. There's no way. Quality! Well, I'm going to cut this off too because, well, it's fun and dangerous and that makes me excited in life and uh, it'll be easier. Ta-da! Ow, I just hit my forehead on my trailer hitch. Love that. Woo! Oh, yeah. <sighs> well, that actually didn't take very long at all. Maybe like 10, 15 minutes. Probably gonna be a pretty short video. I know I missed last week's upload. Uh, oh, that's horrific. Oh, my God. That's so bad. It's, it's straight pipe now. Uh, I guess not technically. And this is what we cut off of it, so... Went ahead and laid it out. As you can see, the muffler, the tailpipe, the resonator, and then the actual tailpipe. So I really, really, really hope this thing does not sound like a tractor or sound like a squad of the shit bucks, but it probably does. So uh, here's my first reaction to what it sounds like. Oh God, I'm scared. <laughs> girl got 
got some talk back in her. She sounds kind of good. Something definitely don't seem right. I mean, everything's fine, but it doesn't sound straight piped, which is weird. I guess it's, I know it's not technically straight pipe because it's still got a cat on it, but I cut the muffler and the resonator off. And for those of you that are saying it's not a resonator in the comments, yes it is, I promise you. Does anybody know what this valve is? I mean, I'm sure it does something for that V8 to V4, but uh, I don't know. I don't know how I like that. Now that the truck is running, I almost just got tetanus on my hand. That would have been super duper exciting for me on a day like today. We are gonna go drive it. I do have a 100,000 video surprise for y'all. I did buy something. It's currently at the shop being worked on right now, but I did buy something. I bought something big. Big for the channel, big for me. Honestly, very, very excited to get it. Should be done, I think he said beginning of January, maybe end of December, so we are almost there. The garage is closing. We are gonna go ahead and take the first ride in the Chevrolet to see what it sounds like. I'm honestly very excited. I'm also honestly very scared. Y'all guys cannot see me, just give it a second. All right, perfect. Go ahead and send it. I'm gonna send y'all in my cup holder. Hopefully y'all guys can see me. I know y'all can, but it might just be a little bit crooked, so deal with that for a second. We are gonna roll the windows down, turn the heat off, turn the radio off. Nothing's making noise. And we are gonna listen to what this truck sounds like. I just hope it doesn't clap. That's all I care about. I'm not one of them squatted boys. I never will be. shit but it doesn't i mean hell i can hear my tires over my exhaust which is crazy because tires really aren't that loud but it sounds good actually it's got a little rumble to it it honestly kind of sounds like a magnaflow exhaust fellas ladies mission accomplished Thing sounds good. I'm gonna go and actually set my tripod at my driveway and give y'all a drive-by of what it sounds like. Hopefully you can hear it. I don't know if you're gonna be able to. I mean, you might just hear the tires over the exhaust, but it's really, it doesn't clap. It's not obnoxiously loud. It's got a little bit healthier of a tone in it now. And I think it sounds pretty damn good, actually. I'm honestly surprised. gentlemen I am honestly surprised with the way this truck sounds it's got a little bit of a purr to it now it's not dead balls quiet it sounds good it doesn't clap doesn't make any obnoxious noises I think I might just drive it over to Braden's house and show them and let them listen to it because Braden told me don't cut it off it's gonna sound like shit but I think this thing sounds kind of good if I'm being reasonable with myself. Maybe I'll just go in the driveway and rev bomb it. See whoever comes out. He's already in the driveway. Hey! Hey! It don't 
don't sound bad at all. Oh, so you see what had happened was, is that I cut in front, or I cut behind the muffler, right? Uh -huh. And as soon as I did that, the muffler started hanging. Uh -huh. So I had to put my tripod underneath the muffler to hold it up, and then I put a kickstand, or a stand underneath there, so then I cut the muffler off. That's so, literally just a cat. That's just a cat? That's just it's a cat. It's not It's not loud, it don't clap. I think it sounds really good. It didn't sound like, I, I tell it wasn't stock, but yeah. I didn't think much of it. I really thought it was gonna clap, but it didn't, so I think it sounds pretty good. So yeah, no, that's way fucking better. Than I'm definitely gonna, gonna oh yeah, it's definitely way better than stock too, cause oh, you yeah. cannot hear this truck. But, I'm not gonna finish this video off right here. I will probably pick it back up in just a little bit, but I am gonna go inside and say hey to the boys, and then after that, I will see y'all and finish off this video. Well, Christian decided he wanted to come here. how it sounds. What do you think it's going to sound like, Christian? Uh, like shit, probably. You think so? Yeah. All right, well, let's go over here to the passenger side. Uh, I used to have a Mustang, and I cut off my exhaust, yeah. and it sounded terrible. It, it under here? Yeah. Literally oh, right there. Oh, gosh. You, like, just sl sliced it off. Yeah, I just, <laughs> I, I saw his audit right off. <laughs> okay, let's hear it. You ready? Yeah. Okay, that's not bad. Doesn't sound like shit. I need you to rev it up now. Does not sound like shit. <laughs> it's not as bad as I thought. It doesn't sound it's like not, shit. It's not that bad. Right? Okay. It doesn't sound like a clapped out Silverado with straight on it. Like, it sounds like a little bit louder than a Flowmaster mm -hmm. exhaust. Like, yep. It's Really See, that that's bad. what I said. It, it said it sounded almost like a Flowmaster, but just a little bit more raspier. But it doesn't clap. It doesn't. It's not obnoxiously loud. It still sounds good. It's got a little bit of a rumble. Better than that thing oh over gosh, there. That is rough. That is rough. <laughs> if y'all haven't seen that, that's Dylan's new truck. And it's it literally has. Sh yeah. <laughs> See? There you go. It literally has straights on it with nothing. I actually sold Dylan my exhaust off of the green truck I've had ever since and he needs to hurry up and do something with that because like that yeah, no. you're good <laughs> it doesn't sound anything like that oh god that's horrific imagine you just wake up in the morning and, like you're late for work and you just want to be quiet yeah, oh, yeah. and you got to get in your truck and hear that every yeah. morning nope. no not happening no oh, that's probably driving accurate yeah right <laughs> Well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. I know it was pretty short, but it's something that I wanted to do for y'all since we did hit 100,000. This is not the 100,000 video, but it is something that I wanted to do for y'all. I am probably not going to cut the exhaust off the Tacoma because, like I said, it is a hunting truck. I want to keep that a little bit quieter than this. This does not sound bad. I'm honestly really excited with the way that this turned out. So... If you are not already subscribed, make sure to do so. We are climbing. I think right now we're already at 104,000. So thank you so much to everybody that has subscribed. Thank you so much to everybody that is following this, that helped me live my dream. I am truly greatly appreciative of it. So all I can say is thank you, and I will see y'all Thursday on the next video. Peace. She's bitchy. She really is though. Attitude's a little bit shit. Yeah. Wanna take it to the city. Yeah. She talk shit on girls just for being pretty.